YouTube, how's it going? Selena here, and in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to get wax off of um, fabric. If you have not watched, or if you want to know how I how this happened, um, I will link the video up in the cards and also down below. So, what you will need is a knife and iron and some paper towels so the first thing that you are going to do is get off all of the extra wax um, and you'll take the knife and just scrape off all of the extra wax without uh, messing up the fabric So I'll come back when that's finished. Okay, so here's what the spot looks like now. Um, I could have done like a little bit better right here, but um, I only have like a little bit of time to get this done because my son is sleeping right now. It's a pretty big spot. So what we are going to do is take our paper towels. I'm going to use two big sheets, but you can use one. Hold on. Okay, so you're going to take your paper towel and place it over the area. And then you're going to iron it up with your iron. And now you can see that the wax is starting to melt and the paper towel is soaking up. So there you go. And since this is such a big spot, I'm just trying to make sure that um, I get like the whole paper towel warm so that I can get up as much as possible with one paper towel. And now I'm going to pick this up. And you just keep doing this until you've gotten it uh, as much as you can off. So when you're finished, the paper towel will look like this. Like you'll start getting less and less and eventually you won't get anything at all. And then this is what it looks like after. And afterwards you're just supposed to let it dry. From what I've read, if you use like an oxidized cleaner, which I think OxyClean is an oxidized cleaner. Um then you can get the stain out because if you can't tell it is a little stained though it's not horribly bad um so yeah that's how you get uh wax out of cloth or out of fabric and i still have these areas to do around the corners and there's one over here um and then i'm going to see if i can save this shirt because we had literally just got this shirt. He'd worn it twice. Um, so I'll see if we can save this shirt at all. And I will let show you guys what this looks like after I finish this. So the difference with the shirt is that you're going to want to put cardboard underneath it so that it doesn't bleed through to the other side. So here's the couch completely dry. This part of the couch right here does feel different from this part. Um, 
and I could uh, take this off because it's a couch. It's got a zipper right here. Sorry, my son is awake. But it's got a zipper right here, and I could um, take it off and wash it and put it in some OxyClean. Um, I'm doing the shirt now in OxyClean to see how much that helps. Um, so, yeah. So, this is his shirt after it sat in the OxyClean for a very long while. And also after it was washed in the washer and dried. So, to me, the top part is a little darker. It looks like it's wet. My son is here, as you guys can see. Um, and then there are some spots on the collar that I didn't get all the wax off of. But compared to what it looked like before, I think I saved this shirt. So, that's going to be it. Thank you guys so much for watching. New video every Sunday and every Wednesday. And until next time, deuces. Deuces.